Once again, welcome back students. As you can see on the board, we're working a problem that has to do with ratio for math PSC paper 2. And there's a chart that they gave us to find A and B. And the chart has some important information that we'll use in order for us to find what we don't know. So we have three persons. You have Mary, you have Kim, and you have Mark. Shears, Mary is the ratio of 2, Kim is the ratio of 3, and Mark is a ratio of four. Then the amount, we don't know how much Mary received, so we'll put a question mark here. We know that Kim received $90, and Mark, it's a question mark because we also don't know how much Mark received. And in order for us to find how much Mark and Mary received, we have to work with what we know. And let's start. A says calculate Mark and Mary amount. Then B says, calculate the total amount of money shared. And A is not hard to solve because A simply says, calculate Mark and Mary amount. And in order for us to calculate how much Mark and Mary receive, we'll work them one by one, starting with Mark. Then we go to Mary. All right, so let's start with Mark. It says Mark is a ratio of four. How much Mark received, we don't know. But what we know is that Kim received $90. And Kim is the ratio of three. So in order for us to find how much Mark receive, we'll have the ratio of Mark, which is four times 90, then divided by three. So it's that simple. We work with what we don't know and use what we know to find Mark and also Mary. So remember, mark is the ratio of 4, so we'll times this 4 by $90 divided by 3. So we know this, that Kim received, so we'll use this to find this. We could also do the same with Mary. We don't know how much money Mary received, but we know that Mary is the ratio of 2, so it's 2 times the 90, and you're going to divide that by three to find how much Mary received. And now since we know that you're going to multiply both person one by one by 90 and divide it by three, and that will be the simple way in order for us to get the amount of each of this person. So, so remember Mark is a ratio of four and we don't know how much Mark received, but they gave us how much Kim received and Kim is a ratio of three. So in order for us to find how much Mark received, and you will always work a problem like this, and you will get your answer. So mark is the ratio of four that it gave us. So we'll multiply mark among by the $90 from here. And because we use a 90, we're going to divide it by three. So let's work that out and we'll get the amount for mark. So mark is four times 90 divided by three. We could simply cross multiply. Three could go into three, one. And 3 could go into 90 30 times because 3 into 9, 3, and just carry up your 0. And now we're left with 4 times 30. And we know that 4 sets of 30 is $120. And the problem is solved for Mark. And again, how do we get that $120 that Mark received? We know that Mark is a ratio of four, and the problem gave us $90 that Kim received, and Kim is the ratio of three. So we'll work at what we know to find what we don't know. So Mark ratio of four, we multiply it by 90, and we divide it by three, and that gave us $120. So we'll set it up. Mark ratio of four times $90, divided by three so because we use the ninety dollars we'll divide it by three and when we cross multiply three into three one three into ninety thirty and four times thirty is a hundred and twenty dollars so we'll erase that because we know that mark received a hundred and twenty dollars so we're going to do the same thing in order for us to find this time how much mary received Remember, the problem was simply like this. In order for us to find how much Mary received, Mary was a ratio of two, 
and we're going to follow the same step. So it's two times what they gave us, two times the $90 there, and you will also divide it by three. So because we use the $90, we're going to divide it by three. So let's set it up so we could find Mary. Mary is a ratio of two, so it's two times the $90 that we know that the problem gave us, and because we use the 90, we will divide it by three, and that will give us the total of how much Mary received. We could do the same three into three, one, three into 90 is 30. So 30 times two is equal to $60. So we know that we could erase this question mark now, since we know that Mary received $60. Again, how did we find that $60? They gave us Mary as a ratio of two. And in order for us to find what you don't know, you use what you know. We know that Kim received $90. And Kim is a ratio of three. So we multiply the ratio of Mary, which is ratio two, times the 90. And because we multiply it by the 90, we will divide it by the three. So we set it up this way, two times $90 divided by three, and that's how we get the $60 for Mary. And remember, in every problem like this, they will surely give you an amount where you will get a person, it could be anyone, they will give you the ratio of the person and the amount so you could find what you don't know and the ratio of the other people. These are the simple steps that you will do in Mud Paper 2 to solve a ratio problem like this. Again, remember, two times the 90 divided by three, we get the $60 for Mary. And for Mark, Mark was a ratio of four, four times the 90 divided by three, and that's how we get the $120 for Mark. And so question A is solved. Now we want to find question B. So let's erase this, and we're going to find question B. Now question B says, calculate the total amount of money shared. We already solved every step. And now all we need to do now is to add the amount that we found that Mary received, which is $60. Kim, the problem gave us that. She received $90. And Mark received $120. So in order for us to find B for a problem like this, we'll add all three up. And that's supposed to give us our total, which is $270. So let's go from the highest to the smallest. Mark received $120. Kim received $90. And Mary received $60. We add this up, and your problem will be solved. Zero, nine plus two, 11. 11 and six, 17, bring on a seven. Carry the one, one plus one, two. So our problem for B is calculate the total amount of money shared. We add up all three of them and it's $270 that shared between all three persons. Again, a quick review. When we started the problem, all we knew that Mary was a ratio of two. Mark was a ratio of four amount. We didn't know. But the problem gave us Kim amount as $90 and a ratio of 3. And in a problem like this for PSC paper 2, they will always give you the amount of one of the ratio. So you could use that to find what you don't know. And so in order for us to find Mark, we multiply the 4 times 90 and we divide it by 3 and we got 120. We did the same for Mary. We multiply the 2, which is ratio of Mary, times 90. We divided by the three and we got $60. Then for question B, it says calculate total amount. We add up all three persons amount. And when we add 120 plus 90 plus 60, we got a total of $270. Remember, you can subscribe for more, more videos coming up soon. Thank you for viewing.